Hey everyone, this is Morgan from TC Helicon. Today, I'm gonna introduce you to our Perform series. These four mic stand mountable vocal processors may look similar to one another, but they actually function very differently from one another. Feels like having come and feel like us. All my friends are out drinking us dry, staying up till seven, still on a bus. I'm gonna tell you what sets each one apart so that you can find out which one is right for you and your musical style. Let's get started. The best way to know which Perform Series processor is which is to look at the letters in the name. Perform VG is for your voice and guitar. Perform VK is for voice and keyboard. Perform V is for your voice. And Perform VE is for voice and electronic, which I'll explain in a few minutes. So, looking first at the technical differences, we can see that each of the Perform Series processors has an XLR mic input and either a quarter inch or XLR output. They also each have a port for USB connections and an auxiliary input. The rest of the connections will vary by product, so let's look at them one at a time. Let's start with Perform VG. Perform VG was created to be a super simple interface to manage your vocal and guitar sound on stage with ease. Perform VG has an XLR output to connect to your sound system, two quarter inch inputs for your guitar, and an input for connecting a foot switch to trigger your settings. The thing that really sets Perform VG apart from the rest of the Perform series is that it has a selection of effects for your acoustic guitar as well as for your voice. This includes body res, which improves the overall tone and resonance of your acoustic guitar when you play it over a sound system. The chorus, reverb, and echo effects here will modify your guitar sound and each has a few different options to choose from. The vocal features on Perform VG are echo, reverb, and harmony, each with a few styles to choose from as well. The harmonies are generated from the chords you play on your guitar, but it also has a room sense mic for picking up the music in the room. Perform VG also has adaptive tone and anti-feedback options, which you can turn on and off. Perform VK was designed to work with your keyboard and voice, so aside from your mic, there aren't any XLR inputs here. You can connect your keyboard to Perform VK via MIDI and quarter inch inputs, and connect to your mixer or sound system with the two quarter inch outputs. Unlike Perform VG, Perform VK won't modify the sound of your keyboard. The sounds have to come from the instrument you're using. So, we don't have any effects or modifications for your instrument. Perform VK uses the information from your keyboard to generate your vocal harmonies while you sing. The vocal effects on Perform VK include anti-feedback, tone, pitch, harmony, reverb, and echo. Perform V is only for vocal effects, so it doesn't have a connection for your instrument. This makes it a simple addition to your gear setup with lots of possibility for an enhanced vocal performance. The effects offered by Perform V don't require an instrument to follow for harmonies, but if you do choose to beam in a harmony preset from the Perform V app, it has a Rune Sense mic on the front that will pick up the chord progression of whatever instrument you are playing in proximity to it. Remember how Perform VG and VK have harmony, echo, and reverb? Perform V overlaps with them by having reverb and echo, as well as adaptive tone, anti-feedback and subtle pitch correction. But instead of harmony, Perform V offers vocal doubling. You still have the option to beam in additional presets for other effects options. Now let's look at Perform VE. Perform VE differs most from the rest of the Perform series. The E stands for electronic because it's kitted out with all of the essential tools for making electronic music in one place. You can create loops and samples without having to use any other gear because it has a kick, snare, and hi-hat for you to loop beats with. Perform VE has one XLR input for your mic, one input for your MIDI controller or keyboard, and an auxiliary input for any backing tracks or samples. We have six effects to put into use with your voice on Perform VE. Double, morph, hard tune, sound effects, echo, and filter. These features affect your voice more than the standard TC Helicon vocal effects. This is intentional, so you can add lots of different features and variations to your voice as you perform or create. Let's quickly review the differences we just talked about. All of these processors can be mounted on a microphone stand and can be controlled by a connectable foot switch. They also have room sense mics for hearing chord progressions to build harmonies from. Perform VG has vocal and acoustic guitar effects and a built-in tuner. Perform VK has vocal effects and MIDI connectivity, three spots to store settings, and lots of presets in the app. Perform V has vocal effects, three storage spots, 
as well as VMobile presets in the associated app. And Perform VE has six kinds of vocal effects and modifiers. Vocal sampling, MIDI connectivity, a built-in looper, and a drum sound for looping beats. Perform VE also has an app for Beamable presets. So, now that you know the main differences between the products in the Perform series, be sure to check out the links in the description to find out more. Thanks for joining us. All my friends are out drinking us dry, staying up till seven, still on a buzz. I wanna taste the honey. It feels like it's real, but I can't be sure. Now my eyes.